As many continue their 4th of July celebration, the city of Mercedes took the opportunity to highlight their newest attraction. And what better way to do it than with food, music, and fireworks? CBS 4's Avril Preciado joins us live outside the Mercedes Civic Center and tells us about this experience, Avril. Chris Maribel, the fireworks show here at the Civic Center may be over, but you can still hear a couple of the fireworks that are being sparked throughout the area. And actually earlier today, several gathered around the brand new amphitheater here in Mercedes, just in time to celebrate 4th of July. Filling up the cooler and firing up the barbecue pit is how Mercedes prepped her 4th of July festivities this evening. We just decided to come over because it's a special day, like the 4th of July. It's amazing. This is the first time that they do this that I, I know of with the fireworks and everything. An event that's a first of its kind at the city's brand new amphitheater that stands right behind the Civic Center. A structure many say was a long time coming. The closest thing to an amphitheater that, that I know of is the San Benito that has an amphitheater, which is the Coliseum look. Something like this is different. I know we've had some uh, criticism on it, but it's something different. Criticism that rose within the community after many questioned the delay of the completion. My understanding was that there were some concerns with the contractors that were engaged initially. There was a change of contractors, and that always takes some, some time. Which is why the over $150,000 amphitheater took about three years to complete. But on this 4th of July, it became a reality. The amphitheater was always intended uh, to be a, a venue uh, for, for performances. That, that decision was made many years ago, about 2015, 2016. So it's just a matter of that the final process of having it improved actually just, just finished not long ago. A venue the city says will also help bring more visitors to the area and residents will be proud of. Here, having an essential location where kids could run, and especially where the park locations at, and people could do the walking trail, I think it's a good, uh, good facelift to the community. Funding for the venue is collected from sales tax revenues that come from hotels, motels, taxes here in the city. And the city manager Sergio Savala says they hope to continue to host more, more events here in the here at this facility to for the public to enjoy. Live in Mercedes with complete Valley coverage, Abril Preciado, CBS4 Valley tonight.